I wanted to uh, get the reader into the right headset at the very beginning, so I put a contract at the beginning that I don't swear that everything in this book is true, and I don't know that everything in the book is false either. These are my best guesses. And the reader promises to put everything in the maybe category until such time as she or he has the time and the inclination to do enough research to decide just how sound the book is. I just want to get the reader into that framework to start with. I don't know if it'll work, but I thought it was worth it. I tried every other method to get my readers into the maybe framework. Even after 40 some years of practice of maybe logic, I find myself sounding overly dogmatic at times if I really know for sure things which it seems to me are only the best guesses I could make at the present. But my perceptions are more and more in the maybe mode. It's beginning to come out of my frontal lobes into my back brain. I'm beginning to more and more perceive things as maybes. Although, of course, the funny thing about maybe logic. Your critics never notice that. I put things in maybe terms, and I notice almost all the really negative criticism I get is by people who assume because I'm not taking their stand, I must be taking the opposite stand. They have a yes-no logic. I put things in maybe. They assume that means I put it in either yes or no. They can't understand maybe at all.